Instagram and at Twitter, at Frick underscore the rule. Let's go. Unstoppable, nigga. I come for it, that shit. Yeah, I come for it. Man off your polo sweater, roll with the ROC, hey fella. Remember me, the teachers used to fell us, now it's so thriller. Uh, put your bullshit smash it, get your bullshit smashed it. Niggas wanna run and get jumped, let the people get your right side of nice eyes. The ruler has your ears turned to the moon. You are listening to Green File, brought to you by the Turnip King himself, Rick the Ruler. You better recognize. What up, what up, what up? This your boy Rick the Ruler, and you are tuning into the Green File Show on Always Live Radio. What's good, everybody? It's July 3rd. Tomorrow's July 4th, so you know it's gonna get real tomorrow. I got Young Turn up in the building, and I got Pretty Boy Jay in the building. What's good, y'all? What's up, boy? Tomorrow's July 4th, but man, tonight looking like it's gonna be a long night right now. Oh, man, you, you starting already? Yeah, it's, it's July 4th today. Man. Two days in a row. It ain't 12 o'clock yet. It is not 12 o'clock yet. So what is you doing? No, but um, basically, you know what I mean? As you know, July 4th is tomorrow. And um, we got a lot of good music coming up. We got a lot of good news. You know what I mean? Basically, you want to give them a recap of everything? You want to talk about the party, Josh? I mean, pretty much if y'all missed Sunday night, you know what I mean? My man lyrically had a great performance out there. Asia Sparks came and represented. it. Killed it. Uh, my man Vado. Woo, Asia Sparks, she killed that joint. I ain't fucking you right now, Vado. I ain't fucking with you. You know what I mean? You gonna say you gonna come and say you need a flat tire or something like that? Nah. You feel me? He said he say he called DUI or something. What up, bullshit. dude? Come on, <laughs> dog. And niggas got drivers and shit. I ain't nobody trying to hear that. But, you know what I mean? Just son. That nigga didn't even have to come through because, at the end of the day, lyrically, you know what I mean? Tore it down when he came on, crushed it. Yeah, lyrically definitely did his thing on stage, yo. He smashed the house down. Plenty of sparklers all night going, you know what I mean? The VIP. VIP was real. Shout out to Alex D, man. It was a great night overall. So yeah. Age of Sparks, O Skis, I mean, Broadway Dice. Shit was crazy. Like a movie in there. You know what I mean? I only remember certain parts of that night, you know what I mean? <laughs> I only remember a few few parts of the night, you know what I mean? I was going out of comas and stuff. Uncut video, Ciroc Ciroc and Molly in the back of the day. (laughs) I was sleeping on the couch when I woke up the next morning. That's how I know I had fun. (laughs) This guy is crazy. But, yo, you know what I mean? Definitely with tomorrow, you know, not only is tomorrow July 4th, but there's a big name artist dropping an album. My boy Jay-Z, Hover to God, is dropping the album. Say word. Word. Oh shit. Real niggas say word. Now, but he's dropping the album, and you know what I mean? I'm hearing a lot of people saying they think it's going to be whack. I'm hearing people saying they think it's going to be hot. I mean, I feel like I haven't got too much whack music from Jay Z as it is, so I wouldn't know. Y'all think his music going to be whack? Like, uh, from, I say from a music standpoint, from the artists we got now, it's going to be good, but compared to old hoes. I don't think it's gonna compare it's, to that. It's never gonna be old hoes, you know what I mean? You, it's just something you can't replicate. He can't even replicate he gonna, that. He's gonna shit on everybody else, though. Of course, that's a hoe. I mean, from what I'm hearing from the DJs and everything on the radio, sound like it's a, it's a little bit of old hoe vintage. If you're an old hoe fan, you're gonna be real happy with this album. Yo, and speaking of that, you know, the album and Jay-Z, you know what I mean? I was reading online the other day and he had released some of his lyrics, you know? Like uh, most of his lyrics to the whole album is already released. You can read it. But you know what I mean? I'm reading them and he's throwing shots at your boy Weezy on there. I don't even mind that. He's throwing shots at your boy Lil Weezy. It's about time. Everybody letting that nigga pass, but he be going there. I don't even think it's on some real beef stuff. I think it's just out of the... the com- like, you know what I mean? A competitor of the sport, you feel me? He's just like showing, I'm here. You know what I mean? You ain't Show really going. big homie is. Yeah, he flexing. He flexing. God flex on your little niggas, man. Yeah, he a little nigga, Jay-Z. So you flexing on him? I'm flexing on uh, Young Turnip. Oh, 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 Young Turnip. We Pretty boy up. Jay throwing oh, shots. Oh, <laughs> we might have to go to the mix early. I mean, why beat this nigga? <laughs> Uh, Justin said he over the god of you little Weezy Wig. This nigga say he just gonna flex me on live air. 
There's only gonna be two hoes by the time we come back. <laughs> Me and Rick the Ruler. Rick. <laughs> the original host. We lost a new member. <laughs> you wanna say young turn up gone, huh? I don't see, I'm the only nigga hosting this shit. DJ and Mary. This nigga is crazy. Alright, Rick, get it. why don't you get us back into the mix, you know what I mean? Warm well, up a little bit. That's what I'm gonna do, you know what I mean? I'm gonna keep everybody in the zone. Tomorrow is 4th of July, you know what I mean? So tonight, of course, is the party. The pre-party. So, you know what I mean? I'm gonna get us in the zone. I got some new music for us. I got some bangers for us. We gonna just turn up on the Green Files show on Always Live Radio, you feel me? Yeah, yeah, ho, 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 ho. Here you go. Can I get a trippy mix? You know what I mean? It's only right. It's only right. You want a trippy mix? You know what I mean? I could, I could do that. I, I, I mean, maybe some Juicy J in there. You know, some Juicy J. Some some good old Ratchet. A little bit of Wiz. Mm, maybe a little bit of Wiz. Maybe. All right. Maybe, you know. All right, all right, I'll get the trippy mix going. That'll definitely be coming up, too, as well. If you want any songs that you want to request, hit me up on that Instagram and that Twitter at Rick underscore the ruler. Turn up! Oh, he's turned up. <laughs> so let's get in this mix right now because I got to turn this guy down. Let's let go. go. Let's go. Some of my favorite bangers by Jeezy. That shit got me amped right now. I'm ready to jump out this motherfucking building right now. You just shot like two niggas and walk back in the building and shit. <laughs> Jeezy will do that to you, man. Jeezy make you do some things you ain't think you can do, man. Nah, but basically nah, this, the, do that shit. <laughs> <laughs> this, much. this is the Green Files show. I mean, this is your boy Rick the Roller. Got Young Turn Up in the building. Got Jay. Big Boy Jay in the building. Jay. Listen, man, I, I'm in the building. It's Pretty Boy J. Let me let me clarify I'm Pretty Boy J before we get Young Turn Up. Like, listen, you don't gotta say shit to get Young Turn Up to turn up. Like, you don't. You be like, uh, it's Cheer. Wednesday. He be like, turn up! Turn up! Cheer! Like, Let's nigga, go. don't you got work in a few hours? <laughs> yes, nigga, it turned up at work. This guy is crazy. He must give his co-workers a hell of a time, man. For Fuck real. my co-workers. <laughs> Yo, oh, shit. Oh, man, yeah, I hope they're listening, yeah, too. Yeah, I like that. We, I hope y'all not listening. <laughs> I hope y'all listening. Don't jump my man. <laughs> nah, but basically, you know what I mean? Before we go in, I want to give a big shout out to everybody that's tuning and supporting. Shout out Aisha V. As you know, she's not here on Wednesday. She will be here on Friday. Shout out EV. Shout out Rashida. Shout out the whole LED movement. Bro, hey, dice, I see y'all. Keep doing y'all thing. Shout out Breadwinners. Feel me? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, I get a little shout out. Let me get a little shout out to my man. Ice on that me. What up, Ice? That's, that's my young nigga. He, he really doing his work. I told him I told him I told him shut me out. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna shout out my little nigga Ice on. Yeah. You know I mean? And my man, shout out, shout out my sister Jackie, you know what I mean? She listening in tonight too. Okay, okay. Can I can I get some shout outs? Is everybody doing shout outs? Go ahead, make it Let me shout out my nigga Ken Dog. Let me shout out A Street nigga hustling. Everybody <laughs> turning the fuck up. Fuck that. We out here, dog. Get money. He just turned this to something that it's not supposed to be. Let's go. <laughs> every every time Young Turn Up talks, I feel like I gotta watch out. I wanna grab the mic, like. Nah, but basically, I mean, 
if you, if you was tuned in a couple days ago, you know what I mean, you seen the BET Awards, you know what I mean, that's what we about to talk about now, because there was a lot of funny things that I seen go down, you know what I mean, it, overall, I feel like it was a good show, can y'all honestly say that? I mean, I feel like it was a great show, and I mean, shout out to my boy Kendrick Lamar, I feel like you own this he, entire night. He owned that. He had the best, I think he had the best performance. He killed him with bringing Erykah Badu out to sing the hook on Don't Kill My Vibe, what? It was in his city though, he That's had to. Crazy. And did you see Erykah Badu? She got so fatty. She got that wham, boy. I'm not even gonna comment on that. <laughs> hold on, hold on, but uh, did y'all niggas see that window seat video from a while back? That's not me, I already knew it was real then. Oh yeah, Erykah Erica Badu's the truth, dog. She the truth. Listen, she got better ass than Nicki Minaj. Uh, shout out my boy Miguel. Like, when you jump on nobody, you ain't bring nobody neck. Shout out to Don't Miguel for it. not jumping on nobody's neck at the BET Awards. <laughs> I, I was a little disappointed by his performance. I, I like, I wanted to see him attempt to jump again. <laughs> I was like, I was like, yeah, he gonna do it again. It was like the same setup. I was just waiting for it. He, he Man, let me there ain't no white people in that audience at the BET Awards. They gonna sue his ass if they jump if he jump on one of them. You but know? Did, you, did you see the crowd though when he's performing? They look nervous and sound like they was like jumping and shit. Like, oh please don't jump. Like every time he got close to him, they was like moving like like oh. Oh shit. Hell nah, buddy, nah, he's, Miguel did his thing now. It, but if you did peep, he threw the mic kind of reckless at the end of the show. I'm like, he gonna mess around and clock somebody in the head with that joint. It's gonna be a whole nother lawsuit. Listen, Miguel, fuck what they talking about. Next time, if I come to your concert, throw some shit, right? Jump on my neck. I need about, I need about 100 guys. You know what I mean? Pause. <laughs> Pause. Go home. I need, I need about 100 guys. <laughs> Cause I'm gonna sue your ass. Fuck that white girl. Yeah, you crazy. Like, I'm not gonna sue him. He's a nice guy. It's just good performance. Shit, take everything that motherfucker own. You feel me? She got a t Sheesh. Nah, ain't nobody playing with that. Anybody, no. anybody want to speak on my man R. Kelly? Oh, he killed it, yo. Ho, ho, ho. I don't care what he did in the past. Ho, that Jeez. nigga R. Kelly set the whole BET award show off. Shout out to that nigga because. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't have a daughter on the way right now. So <laughs> shout out to R. Kelly, my nigga. Now, I'm gonna give you another shout out. Because, honestly, you might pee on little girls and all this shit. Why are you bringing up the devil in them now? <laughs> I don't fuck with R. Kelly, you feel me? It pisses me off that I like his music. Why you hating now? Because <laughs> I'm a hater. Fuck with you. <laughs> I, don't, I hate LeBron, so fuck it. I don't give a damn. <laughs> Yo, don't slam my boy Kells, though. He had a great performance. He got a lot of hits. That's just throwing shade, my nigga. Don't do that. I'm not trying to throw shade on me. Peeing on 12 year olds. Oh, oh, man. At 12, you had a grown enough age where you know. Uh, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. On that note, uh, they're going to close the thing with you, boys. And then we're going to cut yeah. my man's mic off. <laughs> Tell us what you got for us, Rick. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, as you know, there's never a calm day here at Always Live Radio. It's always turned up to the max. You know, it's the Green Pop Show. Everything is live, so, you know what I mean? Nothing get recorded. You get the best of us here. You feel me? If you missed it, you missed it. I'm saying some ratchet ass shit on here. All good, live and uncut. uncut. Always live No radio. commercials, you feel me? But, I mean, we gonna get back into this music, you know what I mean? We gonna hold it down. I got a little mix coming up, too, so we definitely gonna turn up. Let's get into it. Straight uncut that raw shit. <laughs> <laughs> Speakers on lock from the college yards to the trap house. 